Awesomeness is calling. Hello? Yes, it is time for the video blog! We are here to talk about the complexities of life. I was invited to go as a date to my friend's um, wedding. But as we're sitting there talking, we're chit-chatting throughout the weekend, I decided I came up with a conclusion, and I wanted to tell her I am one hell of a catch. But as we're sitting there talking, she's like, wow, you're super nice. You're a really sensitive guy. Blah, 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 blah. But she basically came out to say that I'm a hell of a catch. And I wanted to relay that to you because, ladies, I listen. I care. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Ladies, I listen. I care. And I'm sure a lot of people here, they would probably agree with me. So I wanted to share that with you. I'm so much of a catch that last week, Bikini Weathers told me I should start dating more. This could be the future wife. Hello? Yeah? Oh, that's a good question. The caller asks, who, why should uh, women date me? We're going to create a list. Paper? Pen? Let's create a list of why women should date me. Okay, I was already brainstorming because I was thinking about you the other day and how Ooh. you're such a wonderful person. You are popular. <laughs> you're very funny. Popular is not really a good reason, but okay. It's actually well, the reason I'm single, I think. Popular doesn't mean, like... Oh, you're popular in high school. You should be the homecoming king. It's popular, like, a lot of people like you because you are a good person, not Aww. because you know a lot of people. Especially here at the radio station when other people are, like, upset. You're always the one who, like, no, tell me what's wrong. Or, what you're saying you is I care. Yes. Yeah, I care. Like, punctual? <laughs> what does punctual even mean? Like, you wouldn't be late for a date. Go, um, I'm spontaneous. Yeah, you would like to do weird things. Those things that women find attractive? Yes. Well, no one wants to date someone who's just going to sit on the couch all day. This is an exciting list. I'm really, I'm ready to ask a girl out, and I'm going to see if few they want to go. You know what? I'm going to take some girl to the Renaissance this weekend. We're going to ask right now. Who are you calling? I've had my eye on this girl for a little while. We'll see if she answers. Hey, how are you? Yeah, I was wondering what you're doing this weekend. You want to go to the Renaissance? No, you you don't. Busy this weekend? No, you're you're not. You're washing your hair. Well, you sure you don't want to go to the state fair or do something? If your hair is wet, we can stay inside. We can go to a movie. I've been kind of interested in going to see some movies. No, you don't. You don't want to do that either. No, I no. It's that's not the reason I'm calling. I wasn't put up to this. I just wanted to see if you wanted to hang out. No, you don't. Never call again. You sure? That was one girl. There's like 13 million in Mankato. I decided, the way it turns out, <laughs> from now on, I'm going to be forever Quasimodo. That's the way it works out. If anyone wants to go on a date with Doug this weekend, please message him. We have like, he has like nine Facebooks. Like, there's always the website. You can email him. Text him, fax him, I don't know. Just contact him. And if you can't get a hold of him, talk to me what? and what? I will talk Okay, to we him. need to stop. He's just bitter because now he's not going to have a little assistant. It is your last day. I am a little sad about it. But on a happy note, look what she brought me a gift. A big bag of Cheetos. <laughs> Does this gal know me or what? On the press, thank you. I heart you stunt. Aw, cards a monkey. All happy, all smiles, all grateful. Oh, all because of you. Thanks so much. Hey, you know what? Thank you. I'm glad I can make you smile. Yeah. Let's see what you have to say in the card. Thank you. I have to make sure it was decent first. <laughs> Thank you, Stunt, and the rest of the Radio Mankato for a great summer. You guys are the best. Love, Bikini. Aww. Or Olivia. That is my real name. You have to give one final, one final um, <laughs> forecast. Okay, my last forecast here at Radio Mankato is that it's going to be a tornado tomorrow, uh, <laughs> a flash flood on, <laughs> on Thursday and Friday. It's going to be sunny, and then Saturday it's going to rain and sleet. I love Cheetos. Me too. Bye! For Facebook shout out! A uh, shout out to my friend Liz, who is um, actually recovering from surgery right now. So if she's watching the video blog, hope you're getting better soon. She apparently fell down 
um, a mountainside and then landed in front of a truck, which then hit her and dragged her, and then she fell down another cliff, and that's when she then finally landed on the jagged rocks below, which was just tragic. But she's recovering finally, and uh, she'll be soon back kicking butt someplace doing whatever she does. I want to give a shout-out to all the freshmen! Woo! And the rest of the college students are back at MSU, Bethany, Gustavus, SCC, and Rasmussen. And thank you to you for watching. Video Blog 43 next week, we're going to be talking about Fred Taiwan juggling. Ready?